how are you? You clicked on this video, so you obviously want to see some doors. So today, we're going to be playing some doors. Me and my goofy character. Let's go. If you guys want to see specific content, if you want to see me, this guy, play some like VR game, just drop it down in the comments below. I would love to play whatever game you have. I'm not gonna buy anything. This is Doors. It's meant to be a horror game, but it's also not really a horror game. Press C to crouch, as you can see. You need keys to open locks. Why do you think you're gonna bust them open with a hammer? These are closets. I'll show you the use for those in a little bit. These are also drawers. These are drawers. You can find money, lighters, flashlights, batteries, all sorts of fun items. You can find vitamins, which increase your speed by all of it. I don't know, like triple, double, quadruple. I'm not sure how that works. I'm surprised I haven't, nothing's happened. So this is the game, their doors, definitely normal game, definitely, oh hey windows, how high up are we? Oh wow, yeah we're pretty high up if I can't see the floor, or the ground, whatever you're gonna call it. Uh, door 10, dark rooms, um, dark rooms, they're dark, there are also, there's a monster called Screech that can appear, um, in dark rooms, it'll, you'll hear a pst, like, a really loud pst, and you'll have to look around and look at it directly. Oh, here it comes. When you hear that noise, you have to hide in the closet. That's Rush. He'll, he'll murder you if you, uh, get caught by him. There's also an entity called Hide. If you hide in a closet for too long, uh, it'll kick you out and it will damage you. Um, if you die in this game, uh, you're dead until the run. If you don't buy a revive or use a revive, you have to restart, which is unfortunate. These are lock picks. You, you can open a lock without a key. Items do not carry across runs, but they do carry across doors. As you can see, with these coins at the end of the match, or game, or run, whatever you're going to call it, uh, they get transferred uh, into doorknobs. With doorknobs, you can buy stuff at the beginning of the run. There is an end at door 100. Uh, these always have something good in them, these little cabinets. Uh, the other... Cab the cabinets don't have something good. The like bread box looking thing does have something good though. Comes another one. You will encounter multiple of these in a run. Sounds kind of low. So the the higher the more doors you open, the faster hide will uh work so you can't hide for too long or you'll get kicked out uh another lock pick why am i getting so many lock picks I only carry three lock picks or vitamins at a time in this room you have to find a lever like that there are also fake ones which are annoying Yeah. So you just walk through the doors, looking around. If it's a dark room, looking for Screech. If you, if the lights flicker at all. If the lights flicker a little bit, it's probably Rush or Ambush coming. But if it's if it flickers a lot, like a long time, it's probably um something called Halt. Rush also has a noise. You'll know it's Ambush, because Ambush makes, like, a very distinct sound. You will definitely know the difference between Rush and Ambush when you come across the two. When when hopping in the closet, there's, like, a 1 in a 100 chance 
that something called Jack will appear. It doesn't do damage, it just kicks you out of the closet, and it's unfortunate. It happens. I have to find a lock in this room. If you're near the lock, it will make a high-pitched sound. It's, it's distinct if you're listening for it, but it, you can definitely miss it if you're not listening for it. So we look for the key. Normally, I would edit this out, but I can't edit. So, if you guys have any suggestions for editing software, uh, I'm all ears. Because I get to make better content, which I enjoy. Um, all of the, the whole shebang. You get better content. I get to spend hours of my life slaving away at a computer making a video look better oh yeah the lights flickering now this is seek those are eyes they don't they won't damage you um there is a monster called seek you probably you probably know exactly what seek is uh you'll I'll, I'll show you i'll show you man what a that's something called glitch it doesn't damage you it just happens when a door uh room won't load properly oh man what a normal looking hallway a shame if a black blob with an eye came out of the floor and chased me oh no would you look at that so you run through here <clears throat> crouching through these obstacles obviously if he catches you you just die the blue, the blue door is the one you go to. You have to look uh, for the door very quickly, or you'll get stuck. And if the, neither of the doors are lit up, you have to go forward. Avoid the fire in those hands. Fire does 50 damage. Hands J just insta kill you. Ignore the pounding on the door. Yeah, it might be scary, and you can see him through the wall. But he won't do anything. He can't bust the wall, the door down. Not that I'm aware of anyway. Okay, you guys, you guys, we gotta open the vent. I know someone's gonna be in the comments saying he vented, but stop it. It's not cool. Door 50 figure appears in the library. Figure is a blind meatloaf looking creature. With a big mouth and a lot of teeth. He's deaf. Wait, no, he's blind. But he can hear really well, so you gotta be careful. And if he gets close to you, you have to hide. And there's a mini game that you have to survive or you'll die. Um, this door. Okay, this is a dark room. Since I. Uh, since I don't, I really don't feel like looking through a dark room, and I need a lock or a key. I'll just use a pit lock. That's what the pit locks are for. The big rooms like that, then um, you need a key for. And you just don't feel like doing it, or you ran out of a light source. Another rush. Gonna avoid those. I turn up my volume a little bit. Uh, does anyone really like and or enjoy the new Roblox? Let me turn it down a bit so I'm not deafening everyone. This is another room where guaranteed something good in here. Vitamins. These increase your speed. Very useful. For many things. If you're about to die, you can just dip out of that situation. I mean, most of the time at least, no promises. Uh, where is this key? Oh, wow. I don't want to talk about it, okay? This is the library. The big, grand looking doors is special. Nah, no way. Okay. That's our buddy old pal figure. Uh, he's deaf. 
You have to look for books and code. Ignore his Lego hands. He's very self-conscious about it. Books also make a loud pitch humming noise and they obviously stick out. Maybe he may be, be, be blind. He's still very dangerous though. Not careful. This is the code sequence right here, so I grab that. Since he's coming this way, I would normally run over there towards the closet that's near there. But he was going that way, and you're gonna stay away from him. Oh yeah, ignore. Try not getting on this plant or just anything. Try not being elevated. Because, um, then he will get aggroed on you. I'm not sure how that works or why it happens. It just does. He's not going up there. He's not going up there, is he? Nope. Gotta wait for him to go upstairs for you to go over there. You gotta be careful, because if he's coming towards you, you gotta get in that closet very fast. You'll know, because normally he'll just come here, like, turn around a bit, and then go back. But if he starts, like, coming towards you, like, running towards you, if you're not fast enough, you, he will get you. And you will die. Upstairs is much safer than down here, for many reasons. I don't know why his uh walking animations glitched, but he gets faster. The more books you collect, the faster he goes. Um, if I like stop talking, it's probably because I'm trying to focus. You normally just start guessing. I'll probably do. Just finding that. See, he is very fast now. He is a speedy boy. He's a very speedy boy, in fact. What you do normally here? On the chat and type. See how these shapes have a corresponding number? Only some of them do. See how I don't have that last number? It doesn't really matter. You can just guess. Oh, now you come up here. Okay, I, I see how it is. I see how it is. I see. He does get stuck on a lot of things, which can be concerning because it gives him bigger opportunity to see you. Is he stuck on something again? I say see you as if he's not blind. It's down there. Oh, I keep messing that up. Is he really, like, stuck stuck down there? You just kind of guess. Since he's stuck down there, I can keep guessing. Or his sound's glitched, I'm about to die. Uh, one of the two. There he goes. He's a very loud boy. He's stuck. That's not good. Go away. If he starts running towards you this way, you gotta hide. Did I do three? I think I did three, and that was a waste of an attempt. Wow. He can't get you anymore, don't worry. He won't hurt you, it's okay. Lovely, starting off. There's no closet. 
There's probably nothing gonna spawn. Nothing's gonna spawn, probably. Yeah, it's just unfortunate. I should have just checked over here first. I let him get a lot closer than you should. Because, um, I want to make... I'm just kind of used to it, because later on, hide comes so fast. On 99, you have, like, five seconds to, like, be in that closet and get out. It's crazy how fast it happens. Another one? Nah. I swear I hear something. Why is that making funny noises? Okay. Hey, no. Mm-mm. That one's real. Another key room. There's the key. I have beaten this game before, keep that in mind. I don't think anything's coming. I hope not, at least. There is a closet, so it, something could happen. Gotta match the paintings with that outline on this level. Whoa, buddy. See, that was a lot scarier than normal because it sounded like he was closer, even though it was just the way the rooms are shaped. I'm not gonna loot. This video's already becoming pretty long. Not like I have to edit, just because watching long videos is a pain. On a level like this, it's light, it's brighter in here. I just have a higher chance of getting hacked by Screech without a light. At right there is what what you that's what you're looking for. That's not what you want, but it's what you're looking for if you hear a See that's another rush. I'll, I'll let you know. I'll let you know when it's an ambush. I'll let you know. This is garden. Hmm. Favorite level. Take a look around. As everyone says, let's be honest, why doesn't why don't we just stay here instead of having to deal with these scary monsters? There's this heard there's ambience above us. But nothing's above us. Unless it's Jesus. Or whatever God you believe in. Hello? Yep. Another rush. Ambush is also green. Like a greenish. Don't knock. That's fine. That's nothing. Shelves. I was looking for a globe. Didn't find one though. I mean, obviously. Another rush, as you can tell. And there it was. That was rush. Another one, like the eighth one, yo, typewriter. That doesn't do anything. Wow. Up knocking, that's not cool. When you're first playing this game, it's it's pretty scary because the ambience, and there's so many monsters. 
you just all you just think everything is a monster coming but most of the time it's not uh, there is another secret scene so if you guys were for some reason especially excited about seeing another seek scene you're not good the lights just flicker it, oh right I told you there's another one this one's harder it's longer uh G said that was a really bad joke I'm so I'm sorry um oh man what a normal hallway I hope that weird thing doesn't come back to get me I'll use the vitamins why not here he is here he comes See, now I'm the one who's fast. I'm the fast one. Getting stuck could normally be very bad, but I took vitamins, so... Vitamins do give, like... Uh, they don't give a health boost, but they heal your health slightly over time. By over time, I mean, like, they'll heal a very little amount of health over a period of, like, 20 or so seconds. Or is this a fun game? It's well made. There's not many glitches that I'm aware of, at least. I mean, other than glitch. Um. Hello? Something on its way? No? I'm on edge. The lights flickered, but nothing's happening. Neat. What happened to all the ambience? Like, the knocking? What happened? Lovely, lovely. That's cool. Hey! That's... It's okay. No ambush? There has to be something, right? There has to be an ambush. There's no ambush this run. This whole run. There's always at least there's normally at least one, sometimes two ambushes. Our buddy figure is here again. I'm it's not really a glitch, but more of a bug. You're normally you're you're meant to run away. And um you're meant to run. But I didn't. I mean, I ran up the stairs. I got stuck there. I'm surprised I didn't die there. You can't use a lockpick. You gotta go to the elevator to get the key. Normally, you have to go in there, sneak around. Um... Not sure if he can attack you in here. Okay, so this is how this mini game works. I flick all of these on. I just do that to make it easier. The, these will flicker on and off with a number, so three and five have to be off. Three, five, and nine have to be off, but the other ones have to be on. You see, you see how this works? Did I see a nine in there, or did I just mess up? It's fine if you mess up; you're not going to die or anything. Nothing really happens if you mess up, you just gotta restart it. I do believe, um... It's not its not exactly a good thing if you mess up, but it's fine. You're not gonna get jump-scared by the boogeyman. I've beaten this game a couple times. Um, not too many. But once you win, I'll, I'll stop the video before I get to the end so I don't spoil it. But, um... Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.